24 April 2004, the Arabian Sea, coastal Iraq. 13 months after toppling Saddam Hussein's regime in Iraq, coalition forces are fighting al-Qaeda terrorists and a homegrown insurgency. Third-class petty officer Nathan Bruckenthal, a member of a U.S. Coast Guard law enforcement team deployed with Coast Guard Patrol Forces Southwest Asia, is among a crew of an inflatable providing security around a major oil terminal. Their rib, deployed from USS Firebolt, has turned away 10 unauthorized vessels when it moves to intercept a vessel that has ignored their commands. The vessel, a fishing dhow, is on a course that will take it in close to the oil terminal as the rib moves into its path. Abruptly, the dhow alters course toward the rib and explodes at close range, overturning the rib. The blast alerted security teams on the terminal who acted quickly to disable two other boats full of explosives before they could reach their target. Bruckenthal was pulled from the water where he later died of his wounds. Fellow petty officers Christopher Watts and Michael J. Pernicelli were also in the same rib and also perished. Petty officer Bruckenthal was the first Coast Guardsman killed in action since the Vietnam War. His actions that day and those of the security team prevented a large-scale environmental disaster and a strategic blow to the coalition forces. For his bravery, Petty Officer Bruckenthal posthumously received the Bronze Star with Combat V. Third Class Petty Officer Nathan Bruckenthal, duty and sacrifice in the service of his country.